moment the situation in Muzaffarabad, the capital of Pakistani occupied Jammu Kashmir, is getting very, very serious. What happened is this morning, about 500,000 people descended upon Muzaffarabad and in the suburbs to protest against uh, taxes on electricity bills, uh, cuts in subsidies, and to demand an uh, end to the perks and privileges of the Prime Minister, the President, all members of Legislative Assembly as well as the judges and bureaucracy. And uh, then they, uh, the government of POJK suddenly announced that they have reached an agreement, they issued a notification and they said that uh, electricity, the first 100 units of electricity will be charged instead of 30, 40, 50 rupees per unit, it will be charged at a fixed rate of 3 rupees per unit and so on and so forth. And they also uh, said that the prices of the wheat have been reduced by uh, about six, seven hundred rupees a, a, a mon. And uh, also that the, pa the Pakistan government has agreed to give an annual uh, grant of 23 billion rupees uh, for uh, facilitating these uh, price, uh, new prices. But then the notification was noticed that the notification did not have a dispatch number. When you issue a notification, there is a dispatch number that was missing. So that then made the people, uh, the leaders of uh, Jammu Kashmir Joint Imami Action Committee curious about it. And they asked people to march towards uh, Gilani Square, which is now called, I think, Aziz Chowk. And as they were heading towards there, the rangers then tried to baton charge and attack police charge and attack the protesters. The protesters hit back and the rangers uh, retreated. They, it seemed as if the rangers have uh, disappeared from the scene, but then they came with uh, heavy contingency of rangers. They began straight firing and in that straight firing up till now at least three people have lost their life and um, more than 19 people are wounded and the death toll is uh, said to maybe increase. Then uh, the next thing what happened was that the army uh, commandos started to land uh, in helicopters in the center of Muzaffarabad and each helicopter was carrying about 20 to 25 commandos and they started to land and we don't know what is happening now because the internet is totally shut down and other people are dying. We are in a desperate situation. We need the international community to come and stand, stand by us, raise their voice for us. The Indian repertoire in the United Nations, we request them to raise their voice at the United Nations Forum. We also request the Indian government to instruct the Ministry of External Affairs to summon the Pakistan ambassador and ask for an explanation this is broad daylight murder that is taking place in POJK. Our lives are in danger. People's lives are in danger. Straight firing is going on as I speak. If you are video on YouTube, then subscribe to channel and subscribe to our bell icon. If you are watching this video on Facebook, then like our page.